Hello guys. Welcome to our YouTube channel Pharmacapnaeans. Today we will be talking about a very interesting topic that is extraction of plant material using a Soxlet apparatus. Now let's take a look at the parts and the operation of Soxlet. So as you can see in the image, there are three major components of the Soxlet apparatus. It contains a flask containing the boiling solvent. Then, Soxlet extractor in which the drug to be extracted is placed. The drug is packed in a paper cylinder made from filter paper and it is placed in the body of Soxlet extractor. It has a side tube which carries the vapors of the solvent from the flask to the condenser and a siphon tube which siphons over the extract from Soxlet extractor to the flask. And third part is condenser in which the vapors of the solvent are condensed again. Now let us see step-by-step -step procedure of Soxlet extraction. First step is the preparation of thimble. Here we have prepare thimble by using filter paper. To prepare thimble, cut the filter paper into proper size according to the chamber size and roll it and staple to make it such like a pouch. The material to be extracted is placed inside this thimble so that at the time of extraction only the solvent containing the plant constituents come out of the thimble and powdered drug material remain inside the thimble. Now load the thimble containing the powdered drug material inside the extracting chambar of Soxlet apparatus. First place the round bottom flask over the heating mantle to fit the extracting chamber onto the round bottom flask. Place the condenser on the Soxlet extraction unit after attaching the condenser over the Soxlet extraction chamber. Now attach the rubber pipe at the lower side of the condenser as the inlet for cold water and connect other side of the same tube to the water supply. Now attach another tube to the second end at the top of condenser, which is the outlet for hot water. Now measure methanol in a measuring cylinder and then transfer into the beaker. Now transfer this solvent with the help of funnel into the Soxlet chamber through the tube provided on the top of the condenser. The solvent flows down through the inner tube of the condenser into the chamber containing drug material. Add sufficient quantity of the solvents so that it will fill the chamber and after filling, the solvents flows down into the round bottom flask through the siphon tube. Now turn on the water supply. Switch on the heating mantle and then set the temperature to the boiling point of the solvent. As solvent boils its vapor rise up and are condensed by a condenser. The condensed solvent then fills up the thimble and after it fills with enough solvent it automatically siphons back down into the round bottom flask. This process takes place over and over again until all the material to be extracted from the solid in the thimble is now extracted into the solvent. This cycle may be allowed to repeat many times, over hours or days. After extraction, the solvent is removed. The non-soluble portion of the extracted solid remains in the thimble and is usually discard. Please like and subscribe for informative videos.